Today we're going to talk about uh, irrigation scheduling. Uh, scheduling your irrigation in your strawberries is very, very important. You need to know when to water and when not to water. And what we do here at the West Central Research and Outreach Center is use these water sensors. Very simple method of monitoring your water moisture needs. We soak them for approximately 30 minutes, pull them back out, let them dry overnight. The next morning, they go back into a bucket of water and let them soak for another 30 minutes. We pull them out and then we install them into the soil. Now that they've, we've gone through that process, we're gonna take the, the water moisture sensor and we're going to insert it next to the strawberry plant. Um, we normally would use a soil probe and uh, insert uh, a hole next to the plant roots, not damaging the plant, but uh, putting it in next to the plant because that sensor needs to be close to the roots because the roots are gonna use moisture and they're gonna remove the moisture from the sensor. So I've just made a line on here where we wanna go about six inches deep Remove that core of soil, saving it, and then inserting, inserting this probe next to the plant. Okay, so it's at six inches deep. Then take the remaining soil that you pulled out and put back over that watermark sensor, just pressing it in. Just soak that moisture sensor a little bit to, to uh, pack that soil around that sensor. After you've installed your moisture sensor and you want to check your irrigation needs, uh, your probe has been put in next to the plant roots. We use a watermark soil moisture meter. These alligator clips are on here and we're going to clip those onto the moisture sensor. We're going to read our moisture sensor by just pressing the read button and pressing the read button again. This is measured in centibars, okay? Moisture holding capacity. And uh, if the reading gets close to around 30, that's what we normally use as a reading to start irrigating. This is the low tunnel day neutral system. You can use it with June bears, any type of fruit crop, any type of vegetable. 